uh, I get a lot of questions, you know, from a lot of different people. Uh, some people ask the same question on here, and it just, you know, it just actually pops up. Because if you watch, I actually just did a video, uh, like, you know, a few minutes ago, and then you see I posted it, but I saw the question pop up, so I decided to do the video since I was already in the car. Uh, a lot of people always ask me, I don't know if it's like real hardcore car enthusiasts that really ask me, or real hardcore muscle guys that really ask me the question, why I chose an automatic over a stick. Well, I mean, I feel as though, like, you love the car for the car. It really shouldn't matter whether it's automatic or a stick. Some guys say, oh, you know, it's really not a real muscle car unless you get, the, you know, the manual. It's nothing like, you know, having a real manual. How could you have a sports car and it's, like, automatic, blah, blah, blah. You know, like, you get the car for the car. You know what I mean? Like, if you don't want an automatic, you don't have to get an automatic. If you don't want a manual, don't get a manual. But in my opinion, personally, I like the automatic better. You know what I mean, like, who, who wants to be shifting, you know, with, with, with your nuts clamped together, with your feet all close together all the time? Some people like it. Personally, in my opinion, I find it just easier to put one foot on the gas, and then when I have to brake, you know, put it over to the brake. It's easier. And on top of that, if I ever get a Pro Charger or I get it tuned, all the stuff that I'll, I'll make videos for you guys to see, it's going to be a lot faster than somebody that's shifting it. You can't beat the computer unless, you know, like, you you got to be, like, a professional race car driver and I've seen guys that shift like a computer I don't think it's as fast as a computer but I've seen guys shift like crazy fucking fast and it's been actually amazing to watch them drive and shift but personally the computer will always be faster and there's nothing that's faster than the computer itself I just don't like driving a manual I know a lot of people I, it is fun it is fun I'm gonna get that out of the way first Driving manuals is extremely fun, but at the same time, not every day you're going to feel like driving outside, driving the manual, shifting gears, you know, some days you just want to like, you know, drop the top, kick back and relax, you know, uh, where you can just, you know, like drive and cruise around. Not every day you feel like all that shifting, you know, down shifting and stuff, just let the computer do it, you know. And I feel as though I feel like all the people that, you know, are intimidated to, you know, like, if I get a real muscle car, it has to be a manual. No, it doesn't. I mean, you get the car, like I said earlier, for the car. Like, if you like the car, that's all there is to it. You know what I mean? You get one. It's not a, it should be an automatic or it should be a manual. It's none of that, you know? It's, it's all on your per personal preference, as they said. It's all on what you want. Same thing with your pipes, your rims, you know? Now, I'm not saying go, you know, put you know, a neon glow kit under the car, you know, for personal preference, that just take away from the quality of the Corvette, but it is your car, and you pretty much do what you want with it, like, you, you get whatever kind of design you want, if you want saddle seats, you know, and don't let anybody persuade you into anything, you know what I mean, the Corvettes come in all shapes, sizes, different colors, you know what I mean, different kinds of interiors and everything, and you pretty much got to make sure you get what you want, first time I'm going to pass this guy. shift into the power band all the time uh, with automatic you know you kind of got to wait for the car itself to build up and downshift but I mean like other than that it really isn't a benefit I mean it makes it okay it makes a, a double good extra parking brake when you can leave the car in gear per se and I guess you'll also save on brake pads which are those are the top three things you'll also save on brake pads in the long run because you can use the gear brake but other than that, there's really no no benefit but the personal preference of someone liking to pretty much be in a manual. And in my preference, 
it's faster and I like it better you know personally I, I like the, uh, the automatic better so uh, definitely keep us uh, keep posted with us guys uh, don't forget about the big car show on the 29th uh, our Corvette boys are going to be going out in a huge convoy it's definitely going to be something that you're going to want to see and definitely going to be something that you're not going to want to miss uh, I'm going to try to get all of the you know races that are there and stuff that we have you know on the way to car shows or on the way back from car shows sometimes people try to come up and challenge you because you have a Corvette all the time definitely try to get that until next time guys stay tuned be cool be fast I'll see you on the next episode of Corvette Boys